Alright, so the next side mission that opened up is Hidetatsu's Dying Wish. Could I ask you to retrieve the spear belonging to Master Dosan, my departed father-in-law? Your Shitatsu soldiers are currently occupying the estate, but I refuse to just sit by and let them defile such a meaningful keepsake. So we're gonna go try to get uh, the Spear of Dosan. Well, we know where he died. He died in that snake pit. I mean, we have to go back. Is it the same stage, the snake pit? I wonder. I guess we'll find out. Yeah, this is definitely a temple, well, it looks like the temple that was in the snake pit, but is it? Because we can see the sky, which is weird. What the hell? Some weird stuff going on here. There's actually some weird stuff going on here. Sessai's switch glaive, I don't think this is as good as mine. No, but what I will do. Hold on. I'll put that next to this level 30. Get the familiarity up on it. I don't know if I'm gonna ever do anything with it. I don't fucking know. Do have any uh, equipment like uh, armor or anything? Wild boar crest helmet. Okay. Gives you a life boost, which is good, right? Merchant's Greaves. So I'll get a bonus. What will I get? I will get Amrita Earn plus 10%. Or I'll put those on. Read to earn plus 10%. We get, oh wow, we get four pieces. Key recovery speed plus 15 is actually really good. Alright. Sell everything else. I need those elixirs. I'm super low on elixirs right now. Right now, what, oh, we're not even doing a Kadama Blessing. You gotta be kidding me. I never picked one. <laughs> and Rita increased by 10%. Improvement drop by 1%. Elixir drop by... Alright, right now I need Elixir's bad. So we'll do that. I can't believe I never said it. Holy shit, I never was getting any Kadama bonus. That's lame. Okay, let's buy Elixir's. Actually, we need to buy the Gunpowder Bombs, too. Oh, really? We buy them now so the... They disappear after the mission. Ah, oh, shit. Ah, oh, forget it, Dan. Alright. We can't level up. Well, we need 3,000. Actually, it's 2,500. Oh, shit. I don't have enough. Oh, wait, I do have enough. Here's 2,000 right here. I said use it. Cool. Alright. Uh, Constitution, heart. Heart would give me more arrow damage and some more key. Nope, I'm just gonna do a magic again. Alright. And by the way, can I do one more sloth talisman? Yes! Okay, I did one more sloth talisman. All right. Let's continue. So, oh wow, I don't even know what this is. Yeah, we've never been here before. This is a side mission. We're in an area we haven't been to yet. Yeah, we've never been underground here like this before. So I gotta be careful, this is a brand new era. How much you wanna bet? This will be a story mission later. <laughs> This will end up being a mission later. I know it. What the fuck's that noise? 
What is that noise? It sounds like poison, but I'm not poisoned. Weird. Don't mind me, I'm just strolling on up. <laughs> Good, I'm start getting more elixirs. I'm gonna need them badly. I hear something like swimming. Yeah, something's bubbling around and swimming. You hear that? Oh god! It's these guys. Whoa, nice double kill. Oh, there's one on top. Oh shit. There's one that's trying to trick me. Oh, fuck. There we go. There's no Kadamas on this stage, by the way. I checked beforehand. There's no... What is a Shinobi box? Contains a surprising number of various ninja tools. Use it to restore 30% of ninjutsu items. Oh, that's stupid. <laughs> I don't want that. I thought it was something good. Oh, wait a minute. I have a Samurai's Locks. You can use a Samurai's Heal Point. Alright. Increases bow damage. Increases the number of arrows carried by three. Range weapon attack plus nine. Oh shit, they're both good. Alright. Good. Alright, we clear this area. A little side room, right? Yeah, nothing else in here. Looks like there was other ways to go. When, again, when we go to this for a real stage, a story stage, looks like there'll be more than one way to go, but it's limited here. I knew it. I saw that guy looking at that stuff. I was like, I guarantee you there's going to be a sniper. Nice. Now I can get this guy from behind. Clean. I love how this weapon just chops their head right the fuck off. It's cool. Okay. There's a guy standing here. Can I get him? Oh, no. There's another one sitting on the ground. Look at that. What on earth? Head popped off. I love when their heads just explode for no reason. Goodbye. Oh, 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 who? Who? Oh, Archer. Okay. Heads up, bitch. You see, this reminds me of the snake pit. It does. Oh, you know what? It is the snake pit. But look what's happened. The ceiling is opened up. They just, there's no more snake statues. They're destroyed. And it's all humans instead of yokai. So this was the snake stage. We are returning to the snake stage to get the guy's spear back. Okay. It just looks so different without the monsters and with no poison, you know? <coughs> nice. Shell Con Artist is to be $6. I've been listening to the stream as I'm playing Doom. It sounds like Neo 2 has been kind of frustrating. I'm enjoying Doom, but I see what you're saying about having so much equipment. I forget to use the grenade and the torch. Yeah, like, you get so much, so many things to use in, in Doom Eternal. Half the time, I got, like, a, a go-to weapon or two, and I forget about five other things that I had, you know? I'm sure if, like, you really get into the game and you master every single fucking piece of equipment, it's probably, like, really badass. But I could definitely see... Wait a minute. Is this guy dead or what? Yeah, he's dead. I could definitely see you forgetting about half the fucking loadout. Good. As long as I'm careful here, kill all these motherfuckers pretty effectively. So thank you, Shell Counters, for the $6 tip. I hope you're enjoying Doom Eternal. Um, but for me, it's like so crazy complicated. 
Oh, shit. Well, good thing I didn't aggro the other guy. I didn't even know that guy was sitting there. Where is he? Oh, he's sitting here with an arrow? Seriously? Look. You missed. I reached maximum familiarity with my seething dragon, so the damage probably just went up. Yeah, 374. Sweet. Alright, anything else up here before we move on? Doesn't look like it. So we're where one of the uh, statues was. Yoshino Lover says he's playing along beside me. Should be fun besides it being annoying. I mean... Yeah... It seems like some of these side missions are set up to, to make you fail, you know? Like they're really stacking on the levels of unfairness. This one in particular seems pretty fair. Oh, fucking shit, I didn't even see this dude. Oh, he's done. Sorry, bro. What's funny is I'm noticing sometimes they're trying to guard, and my side is cutting right through their guard and fucking them up. But other guys can guard easily, so I guess it depends on what weapon they're using and their their fighting style versus mine. So, okay, I think I've almost cleared the whole room. We gotta go this way. Remember, this is the side room that had a bunch of yokai and now it's blocked now, see that? Maybe I just sneak up on this asshole. Oh shit, well, so much for that. Goodbye. Boink. Off with his head. Oh, with this fucking hang. This is a dead end, too. Alright, I think I have to go up here, maybe? No, that's blocked. How the hell? They want me to go that way, but it's blocked, so there's got to be another way to go around and get over there. <clears throat> they blocked the ladder. What the fuck? They want me to go this way, but I can't get up there. What the hell? Uh. There's a shrine up there. How the fuck do I get up there? Oh, wait a minute. I think I just found it. I did just find it. Okay. A staircase here. There we go. <sighs> Do we have any mods around today? Oh, there we go. Thank you. Thank you, Anonymous. Good to see you, that Anonymous. I didn't know you would be around. Oh, come on. No, not the snake. Anything but the fucking snake. I hate this goddamn thing. I was having fun with this side mission until the snake. That's the end of my fun. the snake well, at least I got her fairly easily yuck nothing in here right nope nope well we got to get past the yokai in order to get to the next save point which is right there <clears throat>
Got him. Beautiful. Archer's robe. All right, I somehow ended up in low stance, but whatever. He's dead. <laughs> I don't even know how that happened. Nope, see, it's all blocked. All the side caves are blocked off. They made it streamlined for the side mission. Okay, well. Nothing there. It's going swimmingly. Let's see how things go as we exit the cave now. Speaking of which. Nothing good there. The archer's robe gives you extra life. Extra, oh my god, it's like crazy better. All right, it's way better than what I had equipped. The archer straw sandals. I'll put those on too. Cool. Now we're going to the top, and of course, it's not going to be dark and full of demons anymore. It's all humans now, because we already cleared it out, so. Why did I, as soon as I said that there's a demon, oh, come on now. Yeah, yokai. Yokai run bullshit. As soon as I fucking said it. Ugh. Salt. Well, you guys, uh, you guys sure got your feeling of that so far today. You hit me with the stupid paralyzation. Luckily, I stepped away from it. I hate that paralyzation. Nothing in here. Nope. There was a glaive, a switch glaive on the wall the first time we were here. It's not there now. Okay. Oh, I hate these stands. Fuck off. And then it explodes when you kill it. There's gotta be a yokai around here causing this corruption. A warlord's curious. Oh shit, well there he is. If I can get him to come through here, I can, like, you know, pigeonhole him. But. He ain't gonna do it, he ran. Haha! <laughs> he fucking ran. The swimming scrolls are straight out of doom. Right out of doom. I'm gonna try to backstab him. He's not looking because he's an idiot. Oh, wow. Fine. Oh, there we go. Nice. And that purifies the area. Got his soul core. Very nice. Very nice. How much bud do I smoke? I don't smoke at all. I don't smoke anything. I don't smoke cigars, weed, cigarettes, nothing. Absolutely nothing. <laughs> A coin threader. What the? Oh, that was the whole mission? Now compare that mission to the side mission I did directly before that was supposed to be lower level. That was insanely easy. Are you kidding me? That was like a cakewalk. 
I just don't understand this game sometimes, man. I don't fucking know what's going on anymore. But anyway, uh, alright, Seething Dragon leveled up during that. That was great. We got a longbow that does ever so slightly more damage, but... Yeah, the other one's better because of its better abilities. Wait a minute. Do I have the whole merchant set now? No. Yes, wait. Oh my god. Check this out. Merchant's Greaves. Merchant's Akama. Merchant's Bracers. Merchant's Robes. And the Merchant's Headband. So I get everything. I get... Oh my god, this is good. Key Recovery Speed plus 15% boost. And Reader Earn plus 10. Gold Earn plus 5. And then... And read absorption. Basically, it says I'm going to get like a, a special and read absorption ability. Auto life recovery. Yeah, see that? Does that mean I'm just going to auto heal over time as like a passive? If so, that's amazing. I guess we're going to have to test it. I got a new Omnio magic to do. Now, I've already maxed out my sloth. I could learn Barrier. Increases your key recovery speed. Allows you to dispel yokai from pools by touching them. That's actually good. <laughs> That's actually real good. This is good too. Yokai Realm and Dark Realm Resistance plus 15. You know what? Let's do that. That's good. Okay. Cool. So I think I, I'm going to auto heal now is what they're saying with this outfit. I'm going to hang on to some of the other stuff that's better. Stout wise, but hopefully this bump auto heal will be very useful if that's the case. So, I guess we'll find out. Oh, yeah, the blind gamer says when you hit kill an enemy, you'll get a very small amount of HP back. All right, let's see what happens. If it sucks, it sucks. We'll go back to a better loadout. Okay. All right, it's two side missions down. We got the transient blade and a bunch of, of uh, pit viper outfit there. And I got a Yokai Soul Core that can be attuned. So, put the Yoki into the Yoki to make the ultimate Yoki upgrade. There you go. The ultimate Yoki. Here's your attack plus five. Okay. All right. I think there's one more side mission to do, right? Wait, what? There's another? Oh, no, no, no. This is the other one. This is the main mission. Gotcha. All right, so this is a mission, an error in calculation. Can I ask you to do something for me and to keep it a secret from Tochiro? Excuse me, Tokichiro. I dropped something important in Okazahama. What did he drop? What did he drop? I dropped my iPhone case. <laughs> I look nervous. Uh, Aussie Steve, I'm not nervous whatsoever. I don't know what you're talking about. I am not nervous at all about anything right now. <clears throat> okay. I'm cool as a cucumber, bro. Uh, I'm gonna head back that way. Uh, anything over here hidden? Yeah, look. There's already a chest sitting here. Ninja hatchets. Make sure I'm fully loaded on everything. That's not what I wanted to do. I wanted to do make an offering. Oops. I guess we'll just ma ma uh, mark everything here. Trade that shit in. Oh, no, you know what? Oh, no, those are all equipped. Okay. Pit Viper set, huh? The vicissitudes of life. I have three pieces of it. That would give me key plus 50. It's actually pretty good. If you can get all five, it's really good. It's the shoes, the comma, the robes, the coin threader, and the transient blade. I have those, but I'm not using those. Fuck that. All right, fuck it then. I'm selling it. Wait, 
I don't want to get rid of the Archer Rogue. And I like that Wild Boar Helmet. Everything else can go. Okay. Good. <clears throat> Sure, we're max arrows. Okay. We're good. Wait, am I close to leveling? Hold on. I need 7,000. I don't think I have enough for 7,000. I don't think so. No way. It's only about 2,000 right there. I'm good with everything. Is that like more titles? One. Key. More key. There you go. Excellent. <clears throat> Alright. Let's continue. So last time we were fighting humans here, now we're fighting demons. Of course. It's always the opposite. Always the opposite. So obviously we go into the cave, but looks like there's some stuff over here too. This is where the boss was. That's now blocked off. Okay. There's an enemy up here. Did you hear that? Enemy like behind me too. The yokai weapon speaks to you. There was like no point in killing that guy. There's nothing here. All right, now we can go into the cave. As long as there's no snakes. <laughs> I know there's going to be, but I really wish there weren't any more snakes in the whole game. Seriously. Okay. I'm not even afraid of snakes in real life. I'm just, I just don't like the fucking snake enemy in this game. Oh, really? A big blooper. Suck on that! Earn a skill point for proficiency with the jutsu. By just throwing the bomb. Interesting. So this is where I go to continue, I believe. Well, let's, uh, let's clear the room. I know there's an enemy in there in front of a chest. A whetstone. I have no idea what those do. Never used one. <laughs> Look to the left. What is that? There is something glowing and sitting to the left. What is that? It's a living umbrella. I remember those. Well, now I'm paralyzed. Yeah, I remember those living umbrellas. They're a major pain in the fucking ass. If they hit you, they're doing crazy ass damage. So that's good. Good that I looked around. Oh, I'm healing! Oh, shit! Yeah! So the merchant set is a slow auto-generate of health after you kill an enemy. It's not great, but it's something. It at least healed me a little bit. That's good. So, did I come from here? No. Yeah, I came from here. Yep. Which means I need to go over here. Through this cave. 
Okay. No sure all over this. If you go to menu settings, you can have an even more shortcut sets. Oh yeah. That's right. I have like three or four shortcut sets to scroll through. You piece of shit. You son of a bitch. I gotta waste an elixir on this dick. Oh! Look at this. Enter the hot spring, relaxing. Yes! <laughs> Time to sweat it out. That's how you do it. Very nice. There is a soul up there. Oh, man. Darkest Wars have hit level 78. How am I liking it so far? When the game is straightforward and, fu and fair, I like it. But, like, a lot of the stuff in the game is completely unfair. Some of these side missions are, like, just... Oh, come on. You see? There's a snake. And a snake is completely unfair. Every time I see a snake, I'm completely turned off to the game. I don't want to play it anymore. That worked out well. I, I wasted a bunch of arrows, but at least I killed it without any combat. We got a big boy who's gonna roll out the a fucking rock here. Another umbrella. Fuck you, demon umbrella. All right, that roll, that ball is uh, ball is coming. Unless I stun him. Wow! I had full health. I had full health. Oh my god. Do you see why I say this game is ridiculously unfair? Oh, you got hit once, well, at least with a two-hit combo. Instant death. It's like, what the fuck? I have full fucking health, you piece of shit. God damn this game. I already lost almost all my health. And you know, it should be said, even in Dark Souls, low-level enemies from the beginning of the fucking game don't show up late in the game and insta-kill you. You know what I mean? They just don't. It's not something that happens. In this game, oh, look, it's the enemy from the beginning of the game. Oh, look, it's the kid you want to kill you. Like, what? Not very good advancement or scaling at all. You piece of shit. I forgot to restock on arrows. God, I hate this fucking enemy type. Hate it. Oh, 
<laughs> can't fight this thing with the head with the high stance. I just can't. Do you see why this game's terrible? That was a prime example why, right fucking there. That was utter trash. Complete and utter fucking trash. Well, thank you, Rock the Ice, for 50 bit cheers. Now, that was pretty hilarious. Yeah, hilarious for you. You're not playing. I'm telling you, the game is bad. It's not as good as the first one. It's like, it's not consistent. It's wonky. I'm just not digging it. I'm not. I'm not digging it like the first one. The first one I like way better. Too much stupid bullshit like that. That's not fun. In my opinion, it's way too similar to the first game, and they tried too hard to basically make it ultra difficult. Oh, she died. That's not anti-poison. Oops. Yeah, I unequipped the anti-poison. <laughs> oh my god. Stupidly annoying. Okay. Like, uh, here's the thing. I like the fact that I am alternating between guns and bows. I like the fact that I'm going between high stance and mid stance, that I'm using more things than I did in the first game. But the game is just set up to be too difficult. You know what I mean? Like, it's set up to artificially be crazy difficult just to fucking annoy you. Right. That was fair. I was in the middle of my combo. 
He somehow dodged out of the combo, and then I get two cheap hits on me. Well, I did nothing wrong. He was locked into my combo. He magically escaped. But that's my fault, according to the game. Now shut up. Another fucking snake. I still got hit cheaply too. I still got you still gotta have to get a cheap hit in there. Still fucking poisoned. Ugh. It says to go that way. What's this way? A chest. And just a chest. Female demon mask naked steel Kuzurigama. And a warlord's heroes. Okay. Ah, shit. I haven't seen one of these guys in quite some time. There you go, drop. So far, so good. They've liked everything I put down. I didn't have to fight them. I got a Kunichimo rifle. Could be good. It's pretty good. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Got a better rifle out of it. Slightly better. I don't know what happened. It was so chaotic. I know I took some damage. I have no idea why. At least I survived. Okay, what am I having for dinner tonight? My wife is making something new, some kind of a new Mexican style bake that has like crescent roll dough in it and stuff. I don't know, I never had it before, but it sounds interesting. I think that's where I need to go because I've cleared all these other ways, right? Yeah, it looks like the only way to go through is that that yokai essence here. Wait, what's through here? Oh, I already went. Through. Yeah, every airway is gone. We have to go through the yokai essence.
What is that? Holy shit, that's a new enemy type completely. What the fuck? Then he fell. I can't even hit it with the fucking firebomb. How stupid. I guess I can. There's like no damage though. He's still not dead. He's coming over here again. Now he's fucking dead. He's trying to hit me, but I'm above him. Looks like there might be another one in the next room. See that? It's like a pulsating thing. I think it's another one. I hit the fucking... He throws it at the perfect angle to hit the walkway and not the enemy. Oh, fuck this. I tried to roll. I tried to roll. Nothing happened. I tried to roll to the right. Doesn't work. And he hits three times. Do you see why this game sucks? It's too annoying. Yes, I get that far, but now there's no fucking shortcut, nothing. I have to get through all of it again. This game's fucking stupid, dude. I seriously don't even want to do this mission now. I don't. Do you see the difference between straightforward fun missions and missions that are just full of fucking shit? This isn't fun to do at all. This fucking sucks. <laughs> damage. Whoa, there he is. Now here we go again, you gotta fight the annoying piece of shit that can insta-kill you with a roll. Why can't it spit through the wall? Oh, 
Oh, of course! A spinning backslash that ignores my attack. I couldn't do it. I wanted to do my burst counter. I couldn't do it. I didn't have the, this uh, meter for it. <laughs> Just another stupid thing about the game. You gotta be micromanaging 10 fucking meters at once to do anything in the game. I'm like, okay, it's coming. I'm just gonna counter it. Oh, I don't have the meter. It's too late. He's already in my face and insta death. This is not fun at all. They fucked it up badly. They really did. They made it far too complex, too complicated. Enemies are far too overpowered compared to you, even with all your abilities. Oh, anyone just hits you once, you're dead. Well, fuck this game, then. Oh, my God. I did not have a fun time today at all. I really didn't. It was just more more annoying than anything else. I went past the door again. The door I was supposed to go. It's over here. Got to be joking. Look what's next. Now he hits me with a stupid projectile through the wall. He never attacked five times in a row before. Never. Why does nothing I do hurt him? Literally nothing I'm doing is hurting him. I hit him a million times, he's still at half health. Fucking ass. <sighs> Was that fun? No. Not in any way, shape, or form. Alright, I got the abacus. I think was that supposed to be the quest item? <laughs> because you can't equip it. So I can leave now, but there's more stuff in the next fucking room. Right? Right? No, they disappeared. What the hell? There were multiple enemies over here. Where'd they go? I have no idea, but they vanished for some reason. That's weird. That's really weird. 
Like, I don't even get it. There's other stuff to do, but why would you do it? You already keep the stage, right? Are all the enemies gone? I think all the enemies are gone. Because I beat the boss. Huh. Seems like I just grab a few items before I leave. Okay. A demon cat, not that I'm gonna use him. Yeah, look, like you go through the whole freaking stage. Now we're back to where we are. So there was a little extra loop there to gather items, I guess, for some reason unbeknownst to me. I don't know why all that was in there. Then you rocked the eyes for a cheer. See, you know, when you transform as soon as you go in there, try to kill all the enemies. As you see, that's another problem with the game. I've been upgrading my yokai transformation since the beginning. They end in five seconds. It's like, oh, I'm a yokai. Gone in like five seconds. Even if I attack, dodge, I do all the things you're supposed to do. It runs out too fast. It's like they had an idea for the game, but then they, someone said, oh, Let's just make this the hardest possible game. Forget fun, just make it insane challenge. Okay. <laughs> Alright guys, so I got about another 25 minutes left on the stream. I want to say thanks to everyone who hung out with me and contributed so far. Shout out to... Ross Prey, who's the top cheer of the day, and Joyful Oblivion, who's the top tipper. I appreciate that, guys. Yeah, I got this Abacus now. And I got a Wyra Soul Core. It's brand new. The stupid Wyra. So you turn into that stupid thing you spin out of the ground. Okay. Alright. Solo LM Slayer says, fun and challenge aren't mutually exclusive. You're right, but they're also not mutually inclusive. Just because something is challenging doesn't mean it's fun. It should be a mix. And this game so far has really... Some of the stages are perfect, and some are like, what the fuck, dude? Like, this is not fun at all. I want to fucking punch myself in the nuts. All right, the Mysterious One Night Castle, the next story mission. Lord Nobunaga is eager to, e eager to expand his influence into the northern reaches of Mino, a key strategic location where Dosan has a stronghold. Without a castle to give us a foothold, it would be extremely difficult to launch any kind of meaningful attack, but Saito is not just going to sit and watch a castle being built near his turf without taking action. Don't worry, though. I may just have an idea. Leave it to me, kitty. <clears throat> okay. All right. Whew. This will have a nice, beautiful outdoor stage this time. Look at that, a fishing kadama. How cute. Oh, Mataza! Koko de Nanyo! Sireta Kodo! Katsu Yedon no Chikaro Karate Shirota de Nobunaga Samani Kenjo Sirnoyo! So you are gonna. So you get the power of the boar! You got Kiwa Yuru Sanzo! <laughs> what the hell is that? Uh oh. 
giant water demon. Oh yeah! What the fuck? ごめん、それが捨てるって、侍はお前か。ご挨拶だな。お前がこのか。ようやく見つけたぞ。カルキュ。ふん。俺らの力を借りようった物好きの人間もいたもんだ。The merman. He's a like half man, half fish, merman. Sunomata, Mino Province. A bloody grave? There's a revenant already. He drowned. <laughs> How'd he drown? Oh, that was totally fair. He immediately gets a cheap hit on me. That was a waste of time, wasn't it? <laughs> anyway. What a cruel fate to drown at the beginning of the stage. Shironante一から建てたら、偉い時間がかかる。なら、すでにある砦を奪って、城に建て替えちまえばいい。so we're going to steal someone else's fort. <laughs> Don't build a new castle. Steal someone else's. Fuck that shit. Sounds like a plan. <laughs> now. Anything new? The hell's a Kuzugurama? <laughs> this seething dragon isn't as good. It's blue. Mine's purple. Hmm. Female demon's mask. Look at that. Ferryman's robes. Non bond waste guard. Can we seriously find new Yoriki Greaves of some sort? I'm just gonna sell everything. Here's your fire and your water resistance. Abacus is anima charge, luck, gold earned. Ah, it's crap. I'm just gonna get rid of everything. Fuck this. Get rid of everything. One low. Nice. There's some extra constitution, which is health. Okay. So I got like 15, 20 minutes to play. How far can I get in this stage realistically? Identical. Which is which? 
How can I even tell which is which? I have no idea. How do you tell between the two when they look exactly the fucking same? Right? <laughs> I have no idea which is which. Oh my god, this fucking game, dude. With his head. So, this is the one that has some sentience in it. I don't want that one. I want the one without any sentience in it. So, this is the right one then. Bye-bye. Travel amulet. Nothing else here. It's a bloody gray. Oh, your show lover says damn time really does go fast when I'm watching you live. Yeah. It does tend to pass by quickly, I agree. Thank you for joining me today, Yoshino Lover. And all of you, of course. Thank you. This is where I already was. This is where the gate... Yeah, we couldn't pass the gate. And I don't see any way to get past here. So I don't know why that viewpoint's even there, uh, quite frankly. It doesn't really do anything. Okay. all the places are already gone, I guess. I don't know. I can't fucking tell where I am. This is like a maze. I don't even know what the point of this was. There's nothing there. Yeah, it's like it's all dead end. I gotta go underneath that walkway to progress. This way. You fucker. Tengu didn't spot me yet. Good, I get a plunging attack on it, which I'm gonna want. I hate these Tengus. Super fair attack pattern where it attacks five times in a row. 
Can you attack five times in a row? Of course not. You're out of stamina after the second attack. But he can spin five times. Very fair. God damn it. Another one of these stupid things. Uh. So, keep going that way or I can go this way, but this way has a, yeah, yokai cloud shit here, yokai realm. Gotta be the guy in the river I need to kill then. There's a the Kadama right there. Teleported away. Missed completely for no reason. Teleported away again when he was about to die. Annoying fuckhead. I love that he teleports away as he's stunned and about to die. That's great. <laughs> Alright. Alright, I got one of the Kadama. Wait a minute, I could read what he said. Did you see that? I could understand what that Kadama said. I wonder why. That's never happened before. Huh. I wonder if we come upon, upon a breakthrough where we can understand the Kadamas.
Hmm. I don't think I want to go in there. Destroyed. So much for him. Another bridge we cannot cross from here. Closed. Okay. -bum 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 -bum. So, how am I get about... How do I go about going across here? Without dying, because if I hit the water, I'm probably going to die. There's not even an indicator I can shoot this guy. What is that? Do I go in the water? Is this a switch? Oh my god. Oh. oh man. It's the merman. I'm afraid of bad news. Uh oh. Not their turf anymore. Oh, so he's joining me. Does that mean he's going to come with me? Yes. Alright, well. That's where we're going to leave it for now, guys. We teamed up with fucking Aquaman. Yeah, look. We teamed up with Aquaman. Might as well do this now before I forget. Soul Fusion. Next time around, we will continue on with the story mission and see where it takes us. Now we got a good, a good save point to start at going, you know, investigating. I might drop down into the hole and see what's down there first and then check the areas on the outskirts. I don't know. Anyway, good progress today, even though it was incredibly freaking frustrating.